Good morning. This has got to be like one of my favorite places I've slept so far. We are above the clouds and now they're slowly dissipating and you can see the ocean. You'd be surprised at the places that you can just pull over and sleep and get away with it. If you're in a discreet Jeep that's green and blends in with nature. Today's plan is pretty freaking simple. Just need to upload yesterday's vlog quick and then I say we continue heading south. Besides that, I'll just continue searching around, stop at anything cool, keep heading to San Francisco. Let's do it. to a little Starbucks in Trinidad, California. It's so beautiful up here in Northern California, man. Perfect weather, not too hot, not too cold. Everywhere you look, it's so beautiful. I'm just capturing everything. So it'll be interesting to see what I actually keep in the final cut. So I'm in the Starbucks, been here a long time. Yesterday I recorded so much footage in the glass shop that it took me like twice as long to edit today. Kind of puts us behind schedule for the day but we'll make the best of it. Last minute stuff for me just means I'm gonna be running, literally, to find something cool to show you guys. Very squeaky table. I'm pretty open on this vlog and I like to be, but yesterday my cousin let me know that the Patreon account that I've been linking in my uh, description box is for some other dude's account. I have no idea how I did it. If you don't know what Patreon is, it's actually where people that really love your channel can actually donate if they feel like it. I haven't really been pushing it. You know, before I push that, I want people to see my passion in my videos. Earn it first, you know? That's, that's just how, uh, that's how I feel like it's the best approach. But anyway, so now I have to go through every video. Put the right Patreon account, because I don't even know. I have no idea, but I think it's funny. By the time I actually leave Starbucks today, it's probably gonna be just a couple more hours until, until dark. It's like I have an awesome day of travel, and then the next day it's like ketchup. I'll get it down, it's just taking a little bit. We'll still figure something out for the night. A little bit more time finishing this up, and then we'll get back on the road. All right. We're finally done. Let's get out of here. While I was in there waiting, James, who was actually in yesterday's vlog, he quick looked up some places nearby I could check out. I'm thinking we whip up the longboard and go search for some of these places. Or one place that he told me about. The only hints I can give you are that it's really big, like the world's biggest. And it's made out of something very hard. That's all I'm gonna tell you. Let's go find it. That's a pretty big totem pole. The Starbucks I picked happened to be a quarter mile from the world's largest freaking totem pole. There's only so many ways I can show a pole. I can kind of like circle it like this, like here's the poles. Actually the story behind this pole is that when you do a complete circle, there's a different meaning at every degree actually has its own meaning. You know, it tells a story too. It's pretty much like National Treasure. There's a guy who actually did I think like a thousand circles around this pole and then he figured out that it's a treasure map. The, the an entire totem pole is a treasure map. Now we're in the internals of this pole. 
Okay, well, you can take the wider diameter and you know, that's really the main ingredient. But in here, this is like the secret codes. McKinleyville, California, the world's largest freaking totem pole. It's a hidden treasure map. You just gotta look for it. Well, totem pole, it's been real. I say we head back to the Jeep to find somewhere to sleep. Pretty much the last thing to do tonight. Oh, very potent weed smell. Very potent. If I was a robber, I would fly by an ATM. Money, just grab it as soon as it comes out. We're going on like 48 hours with this board. I'm kind of impressed. I went to the drive-thru in Burger King. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know where Starbucks is. Oh, Starbucks is right here. That's where I'm trying to go. How did I go past it? I was probably talking to you. There we go. Now I have my Jeep right here. We made it. Oop. <sighs> California it it's is the bomb. I'm not lying. They got Eden right down there by the ocean. Have you ever been down there? I haven't been down there. The bluffs, brother. We got bluffs down at the ocean. Oh, hey, I need to find somewhere to sleep. <laughs> I'm gonna take off. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I will see you tomorrow. Oh, why am I going through this? Oh,